Previously, Umbreon and Espeon joined the team, and they're coming along with us to see the Great Glacier. Their research is almost done, and once they're ready, it's off to the Great Glacier! Now it's night. Ah, so tomorrow's finally the day that we get to go to the Great Glacier! I'm excited, but I'm still a little sad. Ah, the more I think about it, the more mixed up I get! Let's just turn in early. Night, Shadow. Ugh. Oh. Uh, I guess I should try to sleep too, but... That stupid rule that someone has to stay behind. Isn't there anything we can do? Everyone wants to go so badly. Even I want to go check it out. The Great Glacier. But... How do my feelings compare to everyone else's? I've still got those dreams to worry about, though I haven't had any lately. But if I do have a new dream, and if I learn what I'm supposed to do, then I should really focus on that, right? And if that's what I should be doing, doesn't that mean the one least qualified to go on this adventure? I think it might be me. <sighs> we decided to do a random drawing tomorrow, but... If I get the chance, I'll volunteer. Pixel... He did say we shouldn't deny our own feelings, but I still think it's what I need to do. I've got to make sure Verizion gets to go at least. The next morning! <laughs> morning, Shadow! Today's finally the day we get to go to the Great Glacier! But first, we have to decide who has to stay behind. Kind of takes the joy out of it, huh? Definitely. By the way, I love waking up as Axu. I love doing the- oh! Oh! I thought we already decided that I would be the one to stay. Why are we even doing this? Oh, just do it. We all just want to make sure it's fair and square. Even if you volunteer to stay behind, the rest of us are still gonna feel bad. So on that note, ta-da! We're gonna leave it up to fate. The one who stays will be randomly decided. Everyone pick a strip of paper. Oh, this is ridiculous. Fine. Oh no, all the paper flew away! <laughs> Imagine they did. Okay, one of these papers has a red mark at the end. That's the short straw. Whoever gets that one is staying here. Everybody ready? And this decision is final, okay? No complaining! Right, Verizion? Okay, everybody check your paper! Everyone checked the slopes of paper, and... Oh, it's me! My paper has a red mark! Oh no! Dunsparce, no! Oh, so... So it's Dunsparce who... Well... It's totally random, so... So that's... only fair. That's it. The one who will stay behind... No! <sighs> what? Shadow, you... No, I should be the one to stay behind like we planned. Not Verizion too! You have to go, Verizion! I'll stay! If it means that you get to go, just leave me behind! No, 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 no! Ugh. What are you all doing? The decision is final, we agreed! If you're all just gonna overrule it, then why do we draw straws in the first place? That hardly matters. I'm staying and that's- Mom's staying! <laughs> the dance bars! Amogus right, the decision is final. I'm the one who should stay. And... Verizion, you're the one who should go to the Great Glacier. That's the way it should be. We heard it all from Umbreon. You have to go there. You can't stay behind, not when you have reasons like that. <sighs> and it's just like someone said yesterday, the weakest member should stay behind. I think that's exactly right. And more than anything, the fact that we drew straws. We all had a fair chance, and I still drew the short straw, so I'm okay with it. I need you all to be okay with it too. Leave paradise to me! 
Can you all take care out there? Don't sparse. Don't sparse. So everyone agrees, right? Don't sparse. I'm sorry, buddy. But someone has to stay behind, so there's no real choice. It's okay, Amolga. I hope Quagsar and Victini and everyone here. I won't be lonely or anything. Be careful at the Great Glacier and come back safe, okay? And bring me some good souvenirs. Yeah. So that's it, Pixel. Lead the way. <laughs> right. Then I guess everyone should do whatever they need to get ready. And for now, Shadow and I will go see how they're doing. Let's go, Shadow. Oh, Espeon and Umbreon, they should be up on the hill. Oh, don't sparse. I'm about- I'm literally about to cry right now. Why is this happening though? I feel so sorry for dunce bars. I feel so sorry for that poor guy. He's so great. He's amazing. He's- he's everything. He does not deserve to stay. Dang, Quagsire. Shadow Pixel. We've been waiting for you. <laughs> does that mean- that's right, we finally completed the Entercard. All that's left to do is to summon the Magna Gate itself. So you finally did it! Then we'll head back for now and get everyone ready for the journey! Just give us the word when you want to go, and we'll be off to the Great Glacier. Got it! I guess we're ready now. Yeah, are you ready to go? Yes! Navigating the Great Glacier will probably make for a long trip. I don't think we'll be coming back to town for quite a while. You sure you're ready? Eh, sure. Alright then, let's get everyone up here and get this party started. Are you ready to see us create an entrance to a brand new dungeon? We're gonna summon you a Magna Gate! <laughs> We're finally gonna see it! The perfected entrance to a dungeon! It does seem somewhat, somehow amazing! Mmm! I'm mm, quite excited! Espeon, how's it looking over there? I'm fine here. Everything is ready to go. Alright. Everyone stand back! Here we go! Ready! One, two, Three! My eyes! <laughs> awesome! So this is an entrance to a dungeon summoned by the Enter Card! So this is the Magna Gate! Yes, we did it at last, Umbreon! Now we'll... We'll finally be able to get there! To the Great Glacier! We've summoned the Magna Gate. All we need to do now is step into the light and be whisked away to the dungeon. There's gonna be lots for us to record in there, so we'll go on ahead. But be careful. The gate will close after some time, so don't stand around. Got it! Time to go, Espeon! I know! I hope you all join us soon! All right, we should get going too! Everyone, be careful out there! Don't sparse. I'm looking forward to seeing what you bring back for me! When you get back! Please tell me all about it, please! Huh? Why am I crying? Th th that that's strange! I was planning to see you all off with a smile, so... Why am I... Don't sparse! Don't sparse! There's no reason to cry, Don't sparse! <laughs> Don't sparse! You go to the Great Glacier! Emoga! <laughs> and you'd better have the kind of amazing journey that you'll never forget! Have a thrilling adventure and then come back here to paradise! I want you to burn every single sight and sound into your memory! And come back as an even greater Pokémon! 
You guys, please, please look after Dunce Bars for me. Amoga! Amoga! No, Amoga, you can't do this! Amoga! Have the best adventure ever! And come back to me! <laughs> you did a good thing, kid. Mm-hmm. You had this plan from the start, hmm. <laughs> Cheer up, Amoga. Let's go. You can spin the V-wheel. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Would you like to save? Yes, but my goodness, I'm about to cry. <laughs> uh, uh, where are we? Is this the dungeon? The one they made by manipulating the ley lines with the enter cards? It's so dark. I can't really see a thing. Oh, I hear voices that way. Doesn't that sound like Umbreon? Great! But which way is that way? This way. Just follow me. It's dark, so watch your step. Ah, oh, trapped! So you all made it. But Amoga. Dunce bars. It's still hard to believe that Amoga stayed behind like that. I know. To pull a move like that at the very last moment, it just wasn't fair, you know? But he probably had no choice but to do it like that. And that's why... I see. So in the end, it was Amoga who stayed behind in paradise. Of course, we had no choice but to leave someone behind. But it is sad, isn't it? Yeah, but we... We have to make Amoga's decision mean something. Yes. I know, if he wants, he wants me, well, all of us, to have a good adventure from back in paradise. We have to respect that wish of his, and look forward now, not back. I suppose you're right. I'm sure Imoga would be mad if he saw us all moping around here. That's definitely true. So let's look ahead, and see what lies in front of us. We've all got to be in this together, and make this adventure a success! <gasps> Umbreon! Isn't that... Yeah, there's no doubt about it. That's the entrance... ...to Telluric Path. So everything has gone just as we predicted it would. And now... ...what lies ahead is the real deal, everyone. We are about to enter a mystery dungeon. And what's more, since we created this one by forcefully twisting the ley lines about, there's no telling what degree of mysteriosity this dungeon might have. We don't know what might happen in there. Let's all be on our guard. Got it! The only other thing I'm worrying about now is... Those Pokemon who attacked you two before, Umbreon! Do you think they might come so far as to attack us all here? Yeah, that's right! Now that you've left Post Town, they might come after you again! I wouldn't worry about that. The dungeon is created by using the Ender Cards are quite special. Unless someone used the exact same set of Ender Cards to get here, there should be little chance of anyone finding us. Is that right? Then I guess we've got nothing to worry about, huh? And according to my calculations, once we make it through this dungeon, we should find ourselves beyond the crevasses and before the Great Glacier. We'll need to split it to two parties. Shadow, your group will be one party, and everyone left over will make up the second party. You can always change party members at the entrance to the dungeon. So take care of the selections for us, would you, Shadow? Got it. Alright, let's enter the dungeon with good old Dunce Bars and Verizion. I know this is our chance of going with Espeon and Umbreon, but... We gotta go with the OG team. We gotta prove that Dunsparce is strong enough and we're surrounded. Verizion leveled up though. But the thing is, that was so emotional right there. I 
I literally had tears going down my face though. I was so sad. I can't believe that Pokemon made me cry for a bit. I mean, it's not impossible. And Dunsparce is almost out of it. Why Dunsparce? We just started. We just started. Petrify. There we go. And they fell asleep. Perfect. Now we destroy them all. There we go. Now we finish them off. There we go. Perfect. I get to level up too. By the way, the whole... Yeah, we know this is a mystery dungeon. No one's gonna follow us. Something tells me we're gonna be followed, right? I've been trapped in swirling sand. Why? Why me? Sand tomb is my weakness. We just started and already we're doing bad. I gotta try something. What can I try? I know I have something I can use. Here we go, slumber! I need to get I need to get out of this trap though. Ooh, nice! Verizion with the save though! I gotta get out the sand though. Whoever knew sand makes me go all the whole time though. But yeah, while we're here, we can easily train. If we train, that's good. Wait, what's Dunsparce? What do you mean Dunsparce was defeated? Are you kidding me? I brought Dunsparce along to get stronger. To prove that he can have the best adventure, but remember, we're not at the Great Glacier. So it's okay if he doesn't have the best adventure right now. I just find it funny. First floor. He's already gone. Verizion, you were with him. What's going on? I find that very funny, though. In a bad way. Poor Dunsparce. The farther we go, the tougher the Pokemon are. Like, I don't think we trained enough for this, but then I'll get comments like, Pixel, you didn't train at all. All you wanted to, all you wanted to do was voice the characters. You're right, voicing the characters here are fun. I'm just going along with the ride. I'm really enjoying this though. You know, I've been thinking, how beautiful would it be to get a mystery dungeon game on Switch? Now wouldn't that be great? Just imagine a beautiful HD Pokemon mystery dungeon. Full of every Pokemon- what? Holy heck! Why did I get slapped four times? Oh yeah. I realized that double slap isn't really a double slap. It's more of how many slaps can you slap somebody? Sure, let me do double slap. Oops, I hacked my slaps. Oops, it's all slaps. 99 slaps! Man, B6. Oh my goodness, bug, burn it! Burn the bug! And kick it too. Why not? Let's do it for fun. Wait, Pixie, you kick bugs for fun? No, I'm too big to kick a bug. How can I kick a bug for fun if I'm gigantic to them? Uh, enough with that! Hey, I leveled up for running away! I'm such a coward! Oh wait, what did I learn? Smog. Ooh, I can poison others. Yeah, I'll forget Covet and learn Smog. I can become toxic. Beautiful. Now everyone will smell my nose that is full of smoke. Man, just how deep is this area? We're already at B7F. I'm surprised we've survived this long. We've came to so many close calls. But thank goodness, I've been hoarding a lot of items. Thanks to everything in my little pouch. Wait, where do I keep all the items, though? Oh! Oh! No! Ah, oh, me and my big mouth! Now we're back. But watch, when I start talking, bad things will happen. As usual, like getting a double rollout on me. You know, that's always my luck. Hey, would you look at that? I leveled up to 21. And a new move already? Roll out? Nah. Or should I? Uh, maybe I'll keep it just in case. Smog's poison effect doesn't really happen that much. I tried using it a lot. Man, did no one get poisoned at all. 
Just my luck. Alright, to the 8th floor! And there's still much more to go! My goodness, we are on a roll, and I can't wait to see what happens right after! Maybe we might need to face a boss, I don't know! There has to be something going on. There just has to be. Oh look, more stairs! Fantastic! Man, let me tell you about my boy Dunsparce. He has survived this far. He has become a stronger Pokemon and he's fighting- Wait, he did it? Oh, what Pixel was help, but still he survived! Man, every time he walks off by himself, it scares me. He's like a little baby, I don't want to let him go. Ten floors, we did it! Is this? Are we outside? Whoa, everything's covered in ice. The mountain, I can see it. You're right. That giant peak in front of us now must be the Great Glacier. And there are other huge mountains all around it. It's a mountain of ice, isn't it? Yes, it's the glacier. At last, that has to be it. Right in front of us. The mysterious mountain of legend. The mysterious mountain? That's right. It's also called the mysterious mountain. And it's in that glacier that we'll find it. The Great Crystal! Everyone, look at this! Countless huge crevasses! And even more glaciers behind us! Umbreon, we've done it! We made it across just as we calculated! Across the Great Crevasse! We did it, Espeon! I know, Umbreon, it was all worth it! But our journey is still just beginning! You're right! The reason this glacier is also called the Mysterious Mountain is because everyone says mysterious things happen around it. The details are all wrapped in mystery, but maybe that includes things like making objects levitate. In other words, I've gotta believe that the great crystal that can make things float is right there in that glacier. It will be amazing, that's for sure! So all your years of research have convinced you it must be here, huh? <laughs> If only that were true, but I'm afraid not. Hey, Espeon! It's not funny! <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Of course, we did do research and we did gather all the info we could, but I'm afraid there's not a single shred of evidence to confirm Umbreon's theory. It's all just rumors and hearsay. Nothing more than fairy tales. What? Well, no one knows the truth, so of course there's no evidence. Who needs evidence and proof? Rumors and hearsay. That's good enough for me. That's where true Mr. and Intrigue lie. Don't you think so? <laughs> and here I was thinking you were just some stuffy researcher, Umbreon. But in fact, you're no less of a dreamer than any of us adventurers. Well, we won't be outdone. This is getting exciting. All right. Let's go, folks. We're off next time. Nani? Nani?